Hi, I'm Matthew and I'll talk about Arabic numerals and angles today. The shape of the numbers that we commonly use today are known as Arabic numerals. And I came across an interesting idea last week that explained why they are shaped in that way. According to the post that I saw, the shape of the numbers were invented based on Arabic geometric design. What I mean by that is that each of the numbers is designed so that it has the same number of angled corners in its shape with the number it represents. For example, number 1 has one angled corner and number 2 has two angled corners and such all the way to number 9. And 0 was designed in an oval shape so that it wouldn't have any angled corners. I was very fascinated by this idea and I began looking into it a bit more. And that's how I found the numerals on the second row. Variations of 7, 8, and 9 having different shapes but still having the same number of corners. While this is very interesting that the numbers can be written differently but still have the same number of corners, I didn't feel quite comfortable that these multiple versions of the supposed original shape of the numbers existed. So I looked into it a bit more and this is what I discovered. What is commonly known as Arabic numerals is also, perhaps preferably, called Hindu Arabic numerals because of their origin in ancient India. This diagram shows the evolution of the numerals since the first century based on what we find from the historical documents. And as you can see from the screen, the numerals that have the same number of angled corners with the number they represent cannot be found from here. While I cannot adequately explain how these numerals evolved through history, I think it is safe to conclude that the idea of Arabic numerals having the geometric design at its origin, having the same number of angled corners with the number they represent is a cool theory, but it is not true. Hopefully you found this video interesting. If so, please hit that like button and subscribe. I'm Matthew and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.